Hey guys, it's Albert Sixsmith, and today I want to do a video of my top five J rock bands slash Visual K slash Japanese rock band or whatever you guys like to categorize it. I just like call all of it J rock, and I love Japanese rock. So I want to do a top five because something you guys do not know about me. I love Japanese Japanese music. I don't listen to it as much as I used to, but sometimes here and there. Uh, I listened to some and I just wanted to throw out my top five J Rock bands. So at number five, I'm going to bring, and sorry if I don't pronounce the names right, uh, I usually don't hear their names, I just listen to the music. But number five is D Spray. <laughs> I actually seen them live on I think 2010, 2009, not 100% sure at the taste, the taste of chaos, and they were freaking awesome. They came here with on Muck. They're not on my list. Sorry, I still like Muck, but they're not on my list. But this break and on uh, Hitsumi, man, he was perfect. He was just perfect, and I love the concert. It was so awesome. And I don't know if I ever see them again, but I know the Gazette's coming, so. Yeah, that's pretty cool. At number four, and the thing is, number four used to be my favorite band of all times, but their music, I don't like to, I don't like to say, I don't like to be one of those people that say the music changed, so I don't like them anymore, but their music don't do nothing for me anymore. And number four is Alice Nine. Alice 9 used to be my favorite band of all time. I love that band. I used to listen to them all the time. I used to wait until their PV late at night, see whenever they were going to upload their PV. Especially that's what I did to Mirrorball. But Alice 9 is in my number four. Number three, and I don't think a lot of band uh, people know about this band, but my number three is Clearville. <laughs> Clearville, for me, the lead singer is one of the best vocalists I ever heard in my life. If you want to just categorize Japanese music, he's the, one of the best. And my number two is also there, but number three, Clearville. I love them so much, and I I listen to I was listening to their uh, music yesterday, matter of fact. But number three is Clearville. I love them, but they have disbanded. Actually, on uh, the Alice Nine, no Clearville disbanded. This break stopped. I heard that they were gonna do a concert in Japan somewhere, just for two or three. I don't know their status. I'm not 100 percent sure, but Clearville has disbanded, and it sucks because their music rocked. Number two is uh, Rinse Rinse Soy. I might be saying that wrong if I am, I'm so sorry. They have disbanded also. So, uh, Suzuki. Uh, did his pro a solo project. He might be still doing that, but he has the most beautiful voice I ever heard in my life. Uh, Suzuki voice is so beautiful, and they were also one of my favorite bands of all time, and still are. But since it's expanded, you don't, I don't, haven't heard nothing. I can only listen to their old stuff. But they're at number two, Renter and Soy, and at number one, and it's funny, all the bands I've told you I was listening to them way before I found this band but number one favorite J-Rock slash Visual K slash Japanese music slash John Japanese metal slash anything is Death Gaze <laughs> Death Gaze is my favorite J-Rock, Death Metal, or whatever band of all time 
they are so awesome um, I just love their music it's so good if you like Death Gaze guys give me some likes in the comments below because mostly the people that are going to be watching this is people that are into J-Rock or Japanese rock or Japanese any type of Japanese music but Death Gaze is my favorite band of all time and I still listen to them especially when I go running and stuff I listen to them and yeah these are my top five right here guys and they were awesome if you want to check them out I'll put some uh, links in the bottom of their, some of their PVs most likely you already know of all of them but if you don't they'll be in the bottom there guys so let me know guys what are your top five any type of Japanese rock Japanese anything music let me know in the comments on uh, how y'all like my list should other bands be more on top of the other bands I know I didn't uh, say like very famous bands like Duran Gray or uh, Sadie or a lot of them but I like those two but these five were five that I used to listen to all the time those are my five top five favorites so guys let me know in the comments what you think give this video a like and like always it's out there peace